going to show you how to switch over your output in SPSS to APA formatting every time. So this is version 27. So here, let me show you what it looks like right now. Uh, analyze. And let's just say I want a couple of frequency tables of depression, anxiety, and therapy. We go over here to charts. <clears throat> Frequencies, yeah, we'll take that one. That's uh, in the bar chart, etc., etc. Continue, okay. Now you see this little box here, create APA style tables. That's new. You can just click on that if you want, or just follow what I'm about to show you. Now these are system defaults. This is not APA formatting. So I'm going to get rid of all these other ones. Don't know. But now watch and learn grasshopper. So you're going to go to edit down here to options, click on options. And up here, you're going to go to Pivot Tables, right? That's the, that's the main one. You're going to go to Pivot Tables. You're going to pick on APA times Roman 12 point. And down here at the bottom, you're going to click OK. Let me see if I can get this on the screen. Ah, it's not showing up. But click OK. Now we're going to rerun the test. Anything that you do from now on, it should come out as APA formatting. So there's the same thing. Click OK, and that is the APA formatted table. So that's all you got to do. Hope it helps. MGZ out.